Hi you guys, welcome back to the Venice Lindsay channel. This video is about pretty much um, I'm going through my 20 week ultrasound or 19 and a half week ultrasound. I am 20 weeks um, pregnant now. So it's just an update on my pregnancy and where I am. Um, so I hope you stick too. So pretty much um, what happened. I went to my ultrasound the first time, 19 and a half weeks. And um, that's the time that they said is the best optimal time in order for them to see and do all the measurements and things like that. Um, so I did that and baby girl was not moving. Uh, she was well she was moving let me not say she wasn't moving she was moving she was just not moving in the right way so like, she was turned downwards and she was like moving up and down side to side but she would not turn so they wouldn't they weren't able to get um, all the measurements that they needed so um, I was sent away and told to come back it was on Friday the 20th and um, Friday March the 20th so I went back um, later on in the day and same thing was happening. So they sent me home and I had to come back the following day or on the Monday. Um, with this COVID virus going around, um, I was not allowed to bring a partner with me. It was just me by myself. Again, it's me and Quinn's first baby. So it was kind of disappointing that he couldn't come, but hey, you know, you have to be the safety of everybody. Um, but it was fine. So I went back on the Monday, which was the 23rd and the baby was moving. I made sure, they told me last time to have a whole bunch of sugar, so I made sure to, I I had sugar galore in the morning. I had coffee, I had orange juice. I was like, nah, this, this can't happen. So she was moving around a lot. They got all the measurements that they needed. And this is a picture that they gave me of her feet and her hand. I guess it's, I don't know, like this is upside down, but you can see like this is her foot right here. And this is her hand holding on to her foot. Um. So yeah, so that was very exciting for us. Um, I'm actually gonna show you guys uh, um, that day. So I'm gonna insert it right now. Hey you guys, okay, so I am at the ultrasound place. I'm very quiet because I'm in the change room area. Um, but pretty much we're gonna try to figure out, see, it's a 20 week update. So hopefully we'll know for sure what the gender is. Um, and the baby moves around because of last time, I came twice and the baby wasn't moving so, <clears throat> Like she was moving around, like jumping up and down, but it wasn't turning. And I say she because they told me last time it's a she, but I also you couldn't see anything, so we will see. Okay, so I'm done with my appointment now. Um, I'm in the car, my hair is a mess, I look a mess, but I'm too excited to not record. Um, so, so far, they said that everything is well, what she said when I asked is that everything looks fine, um, and again it's a girl so we're having a baby girl um it's exciting i also got the, the a photo of her hand and feet like they're together she's like flexible like her mama um anyways that's it for right now i'm a little bit out of breath why because i'm so excited <laughs> because she actually participated i drank coffee this morning, I had orange juice. I was not playing any games. Like, she was moving around a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. So, that was very beneficial for us. She was also facing upwards. So, that's another good thing. Um, I'm just excited. Um, I guess I'll, I'll come back to you guys a little bit later um, and really go in depth with everything. Um, but, anywho. Uh, whoever's on the journey of parenthood um, congratulations and I'm happy to be part of the club <laughs> so that is the update from the, the 19 and a half week ultrasound I do want to show you guys my 20 week belly update belly shot update and yeah let me show you As you can see, I have a belly, a big one. Um, so 
there is that it's exciting it's actually like when you feel the belly or you see the belly it's it, that's when it becomes a little bit more real um i start to feel the movement of the baby it's kind of weird because you don't feel that like on the outside because i keep trying to get quinn to be able to feel it but he can't feel anything but i can feel like the fluttering like it's like a fluttering feeling on the inside of your stomach that's how you know she's moving uh, at least that's what i research <laughs> um so there's that um outside of that i think honestly during this time just during this um time of quarantine that we have to be inside the house and we can't do anything um honestly for me it makes me a little not worried i would say but uh a little cautious just because it's our first baby we have nothing for baby if baby was to come in august july and we're still you know in this type of environment it's not necessarily under quarantine but we're still under strict um restrictions so um even i started ordering some stuff for you know postpartum and it says that it's going to come estimated in a month more than a month a month and like a week and this is from amazon and i was like in shock that it's going to take so long so i'm like okay i don't know whether i should buy my stuff earlier will you guys tell me what you think below whether i should buy my stuff by myself and forget about because i'm not going to have a baby shower well my baby shower is going to be in june but i don't know what's going to happen in june um so i'm like should i still wait until june or should i just start buying small things here and there now um quinn thinks i should wait i am impatient and i want to buy things now um so yeah let me know what you guys think and thanks for watching thanks for listening um this is my 20 week update. 